Now, our next film is much better. I think we both agree. Kramer vs. Kramer is an impressive new film about some serious subjects, marriage, divorce, and a child custody fight. Dustin Hoffman stars as a New York advertising executive who's so wrapped up in his work, he doesn't realize his marriage to Meryl Streep is falling apart. One day, he comes home from work, and she abruptly tells him she's splitting. Trying to pull her own life together, Meryl Streep leaves Hoffman behind to take care of their seven-year-old son, but later she has second thoughts. She wants her son back, and she and Hoffman meet in a restaurant to discuss it. They haven't talked to each other for months. What? I have a whole speech. No, go ahead. <laughs> I don't know. All my life, I've, I've felt like somebody's wife or somebody's mother or somebody's daughter. Even all the time we were together, I never knew who I was. And that's why I had to go away. And in California, I think I found myself. And I got myself a job. I got myself a therapist, a really good one. And, um, and I feel better about myself than I ever have in my whole life. I've learned a great deal about myself. Such as? No, I'm, I'm really, I, I'd really like to know what you learned. Well, I've learned that I love my little boy and uh, that I'm capable of taking care of him. What do you mean? I want my son. You can't have him. Two superior actors there. You can see the intensity of this film in that scene as the movie moves toward its climactic custody fight in court. Dustin Hoffman tries to take better care of his son, but that gets in the way of Hoffman's work at his advertising agency, and his boss notices what's going on. Look, look, I can't let your family problems interfere with my responsibilities. I got a shop to run. Okay, look, I regret it, and I promise you it will never happen again, okay? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, uh, wait a minute. It's for you. Pick up 461. Who is it? Pick up 461. Yeah? Oh, hi, Billy. What's up? No, one hour of television a day, that's the rule. No. I don't care what the other mothers do, Billy. We made a deal. Look, I can't talk now. I'm busy. We'll talk about it tonight when I get home, all right? What's that say? As Hoffman chooses to spend more time with his Crane. son, his work slips so badly he's That's canned us. from one ad agency and is forced to take a lesser job at another. His Duh. son loves Hoffman's new office. Wow! Huh? This is me! You like it? Yeah. Careful, 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 careful. Okay. Scary. What's that building near the water, Dad? That's a UN building, and that's the East River right there. And look across there, you see that? Yeah. That's Queens, and look way, way down there. You know what that is? What? Brooklyn. Isn't that where you used to live when you were a kid? That's right. And this is where I work. Wow. Is this really your desk? Yep. Oh. Are you and Mom ever going to get remarried? No, Mommy and me will never be remarried. I bet if she saw this, she'd remarry you. That's a touching scene, and this is simply a superb film. Kramer vs. Kramer is very sympathetic to the problem of men trying to be both principal breadwinner and father at the same time. In this day and age of so many women's liberation pictures, what I like about Kramer vs. Kramer is that it is not just a good women, bad guys movie. Each character is treated sympathetically, and at the same time, each character is held accountable for his or her actions. And so I think what we take away from the film is the knowledge that uh, what an incredibly difficult undertaking marriage and mm -hmm. family making really is. So without any question, in my opinion, Kramer versus Kramer is one of the year's best films. That's my opinion, too. Kramer versus Kramer is already on my best ten list, and I think this is Dustin Hoffman's best performance. What about Ratso Rizzo? Ratso Rizzo and Midnight Cowboy. That's a very good performance, too, but I think it's kind of easier to do a real character, a real eccentric character like Ratso, than to do a middle-class guy like this. This is really good acting. Yeah. And another thing I liked about the film is that it's not a tearjerker that simply goes for the plight of the kid, as mm -hmm. a movie like The Champ did earlier this year. Yeah. The poor kid torn between this uh, marriage uh, that's breaking up and the child custody fight. This is about the plight of the parents, and they have problems too. And what's fascinating is that it takes a very adult approach to this, in which each of the two adults, uh, Dustin Hoffman and Meryl Streep, 
is trying to do the right thing in three different ways. The right thing by their own lights, the right thing to their marriage partner or former partner, and the right thing to the kid. And sometimes the right thing is not the same thing in those three cases. The, the story is very complex for a simple little story about mm -hmm. just one marriage. Uh, it takes you along this way. At the beginning, when the marriage is breaking apart, you're sitting there thinking, never get married. Yeah, right. Then when they go into court, <clears throat> you think, never get divorced. Uh -huh. and, and I sat there wondering, you know, why don't we get more movies like this? This is something about such a common subject, marriage, divorce, and we just don't get it in American films very often. Mm -hmm. This is an unusual film. I know it's getting a lot of praise from a lot of critics, and so people might think it's something with spaceships or a big spectacular. There's no big spectacular, mm -hmm. but spectacular is the quality of the acting, the quality of the writing, characters that make you think about them after you left the theater. Well, I don't think people will think it has spaceships in it, but it certainly has a lot of inner space in it. I saw the movie twice, and both times I was really left thinking about these people and about their lives. Mm -hmm. We both agree that Kramer versus Kramer is one of the year's best films with two superior performances by Dustin Hoffman and Meryl Streep who were involved in a child custody fight. Two very strong yeses for Kramer versus Kramer. Okay, Gene, so we agree that on this program the movie that we both really are in favor of is Kramer versus Kramer with Dustin Hoffman. It's a great film. Absolutely, and I think we learned one thing about each other. Okay, what's I that? I think you are too easy on family entertainment films. And I think you are too hard.